Welcome back y'all, I think this bitch pretty much this is what I ended up getting. I got this sample, starts out with Sounds like some Halo shit. And I love sampling piano keys. So all together it sounds like. Sounds like that. I'm at 90 BPM and I made the drums on machine two. I added 59% swing. I'll show that later. Now what else I added uh, added with that was some um, horns, I think trumpet or some shit. Alone it sounds like this. I only put it on the last four bars. All my loops are eight bar loops. At that limited. So all together it sounds. have this part right here this part's pretty nutty check it out uh. oh shit it almost scared the fuck out of me I thought I lost it again halo shit right final mission credit scene and then again, I added those trumpets as well, but this time I just did note on. Note on, how do I do that? I go to program, go to the sample, click on window, and then if you can see, you have the option of having note on or one shot. Note on meaning that you hold it and as soon as you let go, it turns off. One shot meaning you click it and it's gonna play without stopping. Made the drums on MK2. I used the uh, Abbey Road uh, 60s early vintage kit. That's all in that bad boy right there in my contact. Lacy shit. So yeah, that's the beat I got. Pretty fucking tight, not gonna lie. I like this shit. And then if I wanna switch it back. Uh, Alright, so there you go YouTube, that's what I got right now. Um, next time you see me, I'm gonna load this bitch into the SP555. I'm gonna have some shit loaded into Ableton all laid out for y'all. And it should be the final beat. Um, what I do is that I have my SP555 loaded into my headphone jack, so whatever the fuck is playing on the focus right, it's gonna go directly into here, just by clicking line in. Putting the volume up, and then I'm gonna put some effects on this, see how nutty I could get. All I did was trim it because there was some fuzzy distortion if I put the gain up. And it sounds pretty cool, a little um, it's a delay, I guess.
instead I added this bass line. So what I did exactly to wrap up this beat is that I did end up using the SP shit I had. So if I could just play this, it's pretty much um just some ambiance and then I panned it all the way to the left and then on the right side I had the the horns, the trumpets I believe. For the next loop, what I added was um, another on the SP. I found this pretty cool. What this was, um, uh, I did DJ Looper and then I just pitched it down because that pitch sounds more cleaner than the pitch in the SP555. It's not all crumbled and distorted. And I think this is a pitch up as long as also some reverb and echo that I added from stock plugins and Ableton. So that's pan to the left and then on the right is also the horns but with the note on shit I was talking about. Then I had the drums I made on the machine. Again I sampled uh, Brenda Russell which songs. Um, Get there, and this time I need you. Midnight Eyes as well, and I think a little bit of Just a Believer. Just one little thing. I like to combine as much samples as I can into one beat. And um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the beat. I'm gonna just let it run. Uh, next video, we should be sampling some Karen White. All right. Hope you all fucked with it as much as I fucked with making it and making it for you. Peace. Shout out to JG Cool Two, man. That's the homeboy. Y'all check him out as well.